Hello, it's Dr. Alex Popovich, and welcome back to my channel. Today, I will be talking again about Obsidian and how I have managed to use it on my iPad OS and my iPhone OS. So let's dive in. I have been using uh, Obsidian a bit lately as my personal knowledge management uh, um, application of choice because of the backlinking as well as tags. You can do very limited backlinks in other applications apart from Rome Research. The one drawback of Obsidian is that it doesn't have iPad and iOS uh, or iPhone app yet. It's coming soon. I have managed to find um, work around uh, process uh, that it's able to for me to do that because I do use my new iPad Pro a lot for writing and this way I can write some stuff in it um, but um, I might have to adjust it in Obsidian later on especially when it comes to backlinks. So I'll show you how I do this. To be able to do this, I use Ulysses at the moment. I have had Ulysses for a while. You can use Ulysses and save in your Obsidian. So this is a way around it. You use Ulysses to write it and then you save it and move it into your uh, Obsidian. So we'll put a new note and uh, Ulysses is also a program like Obsidian that works is in a markdown. In um, your Ulysses, um, it does take a little bit of time, but not that much to move it. So I've just typed it and it's been, what, less than a minute until this note has moved into Ulysses on my computer. This is my computer. So in uh, basically external folders here, you can add your Ulysses or uh, Obsidian uh, folder. So mine is called Alex's Notes. So um, I have connected that before. And it's here and that's your, your obsidian folder so now what you can do is just drag that note into Alex's notes okay it's not going to delete it from Ulysses but it will make a copy of it in the Alex's notes on obsidian so if I go into the obsidian we got have this notes I love Ulysses okay it's exactly the same with the misspelling as well as it is in Ulysses. And you can see that italics and the bold has gone across. The problem is the backlinks, um, they don't tend to go like uh, into it. So let's try that. So let's add double links or backlinks. Tiago Forte. Okay. See, that's the problem because it recognizes the backlinks differently in Ulysses than it does to Obsidian. And that is the problem with the backlink. If I wanted to put a hashtag, it recognizes it more as a title. But let's, let's see. So we'll go back into the Obsidian. I love Ulysses. It has changed it. It has made this into a title rather than a hashtag. This is one way around it to use Obsidian on an iPad or to write something in Ulysses and that's automatically then saved and adjusted and everything apart from backlinks and apart from hashtags. I also use Ulysses to make quick drafts in iPhone. Um, and it's mostly kind of for a permanent notes or for a quick ideas. Um, that I can use. So here is my um, uh, iPhone and I tend to use my voice and Ulysses is very good to use the voice. So plus new sheet and then you put this microphone on. Hello, comma, new paragraph. My name is Alex and I'm testing this as part of my Obsidian 
video. Full stop. New paragraph. I'm enjoying this typing and dictating and using my iOS dis- devices to play with Obsidian. Full stop. So I can change it here and then I choose that and I'll just go into inbox. So now we'll go back to the computer and in all it's already here. It's very quick. So this video is about a quick tip how you can use Obsidian at the moment in your iPad OS and also uh, on your iPhone. For that I use Ulysses because it's very easy link. Ulysses is paid application but I have had this license already. I do know that a team at Obsidian is already working on iPad and iOS ability, so I'm sure that this will be coming soon. I hope you have enjoyed this video, and bye for now.